Welcome, FNUS57 here. Once again, I'm back on my Xbox Series X. Today, playing the Modern Warfare 3 campaign. Um, so, I will be showing you how to get the MW3 Death Row achievement. This is a 15 gamer score rare achievement, and it's fairly easy to do at the very beginning of the game. All you have to do is kill 12 enemies while descending in the Panopticon in Operation 627. So uh, you're going to play through the mission ideally on a lower difficulty and um, you're going to get about halfway through the mission. By the way, just real quick, if anyone is having trouble getting these achievements to show up, simply restart your console. They are achievements under the Call of Duty game, which was previously like MW2. So it's kind of weird. It's like a DLC. Uh, once you get to this point, though, where you can open this hatch to go into the interior, then you're going to be able to go down, and uh, you'll basically be automatically going through this hookup sequence. It's a forced little, like, cinematic. And once the power is knocked out, you can start descending. Remember, we have to kill 12 enemies. We have to be fairly quick, so equip your night vision, start the repel, immediately turn and look, and you'll notice that you'll be able to grab two enemies fairly quickly. The enemies are going to be these ones that actually have the flashlights. Make sure that you get the kill on them. Uh, it can be kind of unfortunate if you have to reload because, of course, there is a checkpoint after clearing each floor. You do have a little bit of time. You can kind of like reload in between each floor. Uh, this next floor, there's going to be some guards standing in the back. So there's like one that's uh, right there to the... Um, the back wall that guy right there that was on the ground i think there's a total of four for this floor you can take your time and you can switch weapons you get a checkpoint after finishing each floor so just make sure you go kind of slow descend the floor uh, there's some more guards with riot shields right here towards the bottom and as soon as you have killed 12 enemies while descending in the Panopticon, you'll pop your achievement. You notice the little in-game unlock. If for some reason the achievement doesn't pop right there, then uh, make sure that you go to the official club. Double check that you have unlocked the achievement because the club definitely tracks a lot better than the in-game tracker. And if for some reason it is still locked for you, then you can just simply restart the mission. It's only about two minutes, uh, three minutes of gameplay if you skip the cinematic to get to this point. Just make sure that you're fast enough that the AI doesn't steal your kills and make sure that the enemies that you do kill are fully killed and not just in the wounded status. I hope the video helps. If you did enjoy it, do me a huge favor by smashing those like and subscribe buttons for more content. Till next time, stay frosty.